Namaskaram Sadhguru. Uh, I want to experience this life within me to the maximum. So in addition to my Kriyas, which I do every day without fail, uh, what else should I do to take this experience to the maximum? I want to experience that magic of life you talk about. Thank you. You must live. So what does it mean to live? Not live it out, live it in. <laughs> People think if they want to live, they have to live it out. Party every day. Party every day, philosophy works for some time, you know. If you are uh, eighteen, you're not okay. I'm not… I'm not trying to get… Uh, if you are eighteen, <laughs> And then you may last five days, sixth day you will be down. If you are thirty, you last for three days, fourth day you will be down. If you are fifty, two days you will be down. If you are sixty, in the party you will go down. <laughs> So, nothing, I have nothing against the party, it's not very practical, that's all. And it will become the most monotonous, monotonous horror after some time, party every day. Hmm? So what should I do? The Kriya is only an impetus. It is not an end in itself. The Kriya is trying to enhance your energies. Daily, every day without fail, I heard that and I'll remember that and I'll… Hmm? Okay. Uh, now the Kriya can function in different dimensions when we teach it in the program, we will teach, in, teach it in such a way, it is safe for a beginner. There is a safety issue always. If you are going to make somebody climb up this tree, if it is a five-year-old kid, you will make him go up that much. If it's a ten-year-old kid that much, you know, there is a safety issue. So, uh, it is taught in a certain way. When you exhaust that dimension, which will take a certain period of time for people, depends, some people exhaust that quickly, some people exhaust that over a lifetime. The possibility that it offers just in that dimension. And it is also an inbuilt mechanism that if you hit the full depth and dimension of the Kriya in a certain period of time and stay there steadily, it will open up a new possibility by itself. It's, it's designed like that. The software is designed like that, that step by step it will hold you at a certain place for a certain time. When it feels your physiology and your psychology is stable enough, it will move you to next level of intensity. If you are not willing to wait, for this process to unfold by itself naturally, then I would say once a year or twice a year, or thrice a year, or the whole year, that's your choice. <laughs> you can make it your choice. You fix a time for sadhana, full-time sadhana, maybe a week, maybe fifteen days, whatever you can afford in your life, you can stay here. One week sadhana, fifteen days sadhana, whatever that suits and fits into your life, you do that. For you I would say twice a year, full time sadhana, a few days in a year is only for sadhana, not for anything else. Not morning sadhana, evening sadhana, just twenty-four hour sadhana, 
for a short span of time. If you invest this kind of time, you can do that unfolding much, much faster. Rather than allowing it to mature at its own natural pace, you can push it. You should do that. And of course, being in a state of devotion is very conducive. You can every day sit like this and do it like an exercise. Don't take such vows, till the last day of my life I will do it. Do it today. You're committed only for one day. And see this day that this could be your last day. Possible? Possible or no? Possible. We're not wishing it, but possible. So this could be your last day. Do your kriya like this could be your last day. You'll unfold much faster. Because now you're thinking, next eighty-two years I'm going to do it. So the inner mechanism is thinking, okay, she's got a lot of time. You do it like today is the last day, then it'll hurry up a little bit. Or if we find you're stable enough, suitable enough, we will step in and tweak it up in a completely different way. There are many things to do, but the most important thing is to do the Kriya with a certain sense of devotion and offering rather than like an exercise. If you do it like an exercise, you'll get health benefits. But if you want to explode, then you must take away your inner structures, then it'll burst very easily. <laughs>